What's up, you guys? Today is another keyboard tutorial. <clears throat> As I said before, I'm going to be doing some reviews on Tasha Cobb's uh, new album. I got a couple of songs that I'm actually learning for church. I'm going to share with you. Um, I think uh, I know Todd Tripper got a new album. I ain't really listened to that. Um, I'm going to try to cover, try to learn some songs from Jonathan Nelson. It's from last year album um marvin Sapp got a new album uh which is not recent recent new <clears throat> but i i believe it's fairly new i guess you could say it's new i'm not for sure the exact date but i, I heard a couple of his songs but right now um <clears throat> let's get into this uh tasha cobbs i'm getting ready this is the one with Nicki minaj i know there's a lot of controversy about it um everybody got different opinions but I ain't even gonna get into that right now. <laughs> if you guys want a different video or something, or I don't know, it's so it's it's a lot of people discussing it. But I'm just gonna teach you to, how to play the song. <laughs> so whether you want to play this song for your church or not, that's up to you. But I like it. You, you don't have to include the rap. I, I think all churches are getting ready to practice the singing. We're not, of course, uh, we're not gonna have no rapper. I'm not a rapper, so and then some churches may want to have a rapper or something. But anyway. <laughs> Cool, it's so easy. I'm gonna get straight to it. I'm getting ready by Tasha Cobbs featuring Nicki Minaj. Here we go. Uh, here we go. The, key, the song is in the key of uh, A flat. So, this is the verse. Eyes haven't seen, ears haven't heard the kind of blessing. That's about to fall on me. I'm not a singer, but that's the whole verse. A flat major. Okay. A flat C E flat. Eyes have a C. Just hold it or you can I'm just a pigeon, just doing the chords a little bit. And then F minor seven, which is A flat in the right hand over F. C sharp major, C sharp, F, A flat over C sharp, back to A flat. And then the chorus, I'm getting ready to see. So what that is, the chorus is F minor seven. You start off with the F minor seven. This is A flat, A flat C, E flat over F, and then C sharp, C sharp major, uh, C sharp F A flat, A flat major, A flat C E flat, E flat major, E flat G B flat. So if sometimes do this right here. So bass instead of going, I just go walk it up. So I'm just going to add different stuff so that way you don't have to do the same thing over and over. But what that is, like I said, F, F minor 7. And then I go, which is inverted E flat. This is E flat major. This is inverted G, B flat, E flat over G. A flat major. Then I go to the second chord, which is C sharp. Okay. And then you can go back. You can go to the third chord, which is A flat. Or I just... Walk it down, which is uh, the second chord, C sharp major, uh, which is A flat over C inverted. This is A flat inverted. C, uh, 
of C, E flat, A flat, B flat minor seven, which is C sharp major over B flat. And then A flat is the third chord, okay? So first chord of the chord is F minor seven, okay? E flat inverted over G, and then A flat, bum, bum, C sharp major, bum. Now just walk it down, bum, bum, bum. A flat, third chord, bum. And then instead of just going to the E flat, I go, This is it's just B flat over D inverted. This is B flat inverted. D F B flat over D. Or you can go C minor seven first. C minor seven, which is E flat major over C. Go back to that B flat major over D. So you be so you go. Bah, 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 bah. No, that don't even sound right. Just go to B flat over D and then E flat. You know, I guess it can work, but it you be doing too much. So you don't want to be all over the place. So just do you know. Or you can do that where you go that C sharp, A flat over C. B flat minor seven instead of going straight to A flat, you can go. You can hit that again and go. Which is that um, E flat over G, which you did in the first beginning, over G. E flat inverted E flat over G. So I hope I didn't confuse. So. The regular chords of the chords is F minor seven, C sharp major, A flat major, E flat major, and then you can go again F F minor seven, uh, E flat major over G, A flat, C sharp major, second chord, and then walk it down. Once you listen to it and play it with the song, it'll make sense. I know I'm calling out a lot of chords. You're trying to figure out how that, how that go with that. Just practice the chords first, just by itself. And then slowly practice the uh, chord progressions or changes, or whatever you call it, with that. You ain't got to do that. Don't, don't be in church trying to, trying to do that. All right, there's just something extra if you if you don't want to keep doing the same chords. All right, and that's pretty much it, y'all. <clears throat> uh, like I said, the verse, the verse is A flat major. Seven C. F minor seven. C sharp. Couple times in the chorus, F minor seven. Uh, I'm getting ready to leave. F minor seven, C sharp major, A flat major, E flat major, F minor seven, C sharp major, A flat major, D e flat major. Now the little, uh, I guess, uh, accent notes is what I call them. When you first hit that verse, um, uh, eyes haven't seen. You know, you, you can do that first. Sound better if you double it up. Eyes haven't seen. So before you hit that first chord on that verse, you can go. You just double it up. C sharp, C. A flat major. Okay, so eyes have a scene, then go um, I'm sorry, this 
All right, my bad. Sorry about that. So that's actually B flat, C, and then the second chord, which is F minor seven. So from the beginning, the accent chord is C sharp, C. Uh, I guess you can go ahead and play the chord, or you can just go, you can hold the A flat. Then play it, or you can just go as the the chord, or you can just go. You know, you can either hit the chord on the one two chord or one two note chord, whatever you want to do, and then when you hit that, and before you go to the F minor seven, you're gonna hit B flat C. Seven. There's just a little, I don't know what the proper word, accent chord, I call it accents because it's like you're just putting a little accent on it. But um, that's pretty much it. Um, real simple, real easy. Uh, like I said, I'm going to be covering a lot of Tasha Cobb songs off her new album. Um, uh, William Murphy came out with an album. No, William McDowell. He got a lot of worshipy songs, so I know a lot of churches gonna be needing those worshipy songs. You know, it, we always need those worshipy songs to take us in the throne room. So I'm gonna be really listening to some of his songs. If you guys already looked at his CD, let me know what you guys want. But other than that, you guys have a blessed week. Stay safe, stay in the truth, stay in the spirit. Keep God first. He won't lead you astray. Be blessed.